When Sacco was signed for West Ham, I think most reactions were pretty negative. Coming in from the French second division, he hardly looked like the player to light up the Premier League. However in his first season he found a strong partnership with Enna Valencia and looked to be one of the best signings the Davids had made. But since then it's all been a bit topsy-turvy. Sacco has gone through some dry spells, spells on the bench and transfer shenanigans. Many are surprised HES still at the club. However he is now getting some calls for Billick to start him. Where will this merry-go-round end up? Just over a month ago people were calling Diafra Sacco a bigger snake than Payette. Given the Frenchman's return to Marseille was one of the biggest transfer fiascos in the club's history that was pretty impressive. Although that's what booking yourself a medical at another club in an attempt to force a move will do. But he is a goal scorer, and that will always get fans over. But anyone calling for him to be more than a sub is losing their mind. Certainly not yet anyway. If HES booking a medical at another club HES not going to be loyal and in the right place a month later. Time and performance could change that, but for now HES still got work to do. Also, you have to look at the other players we have in his position. Right now we have Carol Fitt and Hernandez, one of the best poachers in modern football ready and willing to play. Sacco doesn't get a look in when these two are playing even slightly well. And as Chicharito is being moved around in the side as well, slotting him up front should be a bigger priority.